Hello. This is our upper room reading for Saturday, February the 27th. And the title of it is Hope of New Life. The regular Bible reading is found in Matthew 6, verses 25 through 34. But today we have a focal verse in Job, the 14th chapter, the 7th verse. There is hope for a tree, if it is cut down, that it will sprout again, and that its roots will not cease. It's interesting because before we before we read this, we were just talking uh, about Job. My wife and I were. Uh, so in this uh, this devotion was sent in by. Alexandro de Avezido from Rio de Nege, Rio de ne, de Je, <laughs> say that again. Rio de Jane, Janeiro. I've said that a million times. I can't say it. Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. And he writes this devotion for us. I had returned from the city of Natal, where I had spent seven long years with my family. I was about 50 years old and was starting over after a failed profit, professional experience. The prospects were not promising. As I was praying about my situation, I noticed that a large tree in the complex where I live was extremely dry. Sometimes branches fail, putting at risk those who happen to be passing underneath. I saw no hope for that tree and thought it should be cut down. Spring came, and one morning I went to the balcony to look at the tree again. It was leafy and beautiful with a green canopy. At that moment, I felt God speaking to my heart. I will do with your life just as I did with this tree. My heart was filled with laughter, hope, and trust in God. Today, I am a renewed and successful professional. I was reborn after a period of drought. God brought a miracle into my life that turned my story of failure into victory. To the glory of God. God is faithful, immensely good, and delights in the well-being of his children. And the thought for today is God can make everything new in my life. In the prayer. Unchanging God, help those hearts which are dried up by the failures and hardships of life to find the hope of new life in you.